Yes, hello Kenyans. Welcome again to this channel. <clears throat> Thank you so much because of your great support. Now, Kenyans are waiting eagerly. What next when it comes to the ruling of the court about the BBI? That is Building Bridges Initiative. As you know that everyone, tomorrow on Thursday, they are eagerly waiting for the final decision when it comes to the BBI. So Kenyans today, I'm requesting you so that we can look it in these two perspective ways. Number one, what next after the ruling of BBI when, for example, BBI will pass, number one. Number two, what next after the ruling after the BBI will be completely denied when it comes to the court ruling? So without wasting time, if you're a visitor, ensure that you subscribe to this channel. You put on the notification bell that when I upload my videos, you get notified automatically by YouTube. Of course, in this channel, we analyze pure politics. We give opinions and reasons the way we understand politics across the country without bias. So for those who are returning subscribers, thank you so much. God bless you. I'm so, so much humble. Now, let us start with number one. What if the BBI, the court will decide that now let BBI to continue? If the BBI will continue, there are some consequences that either two sides will face. That is Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance and of course Azimiola Umoja. But it depends on which negative impact or positive impact that these both two sides will have. For example, let us assume that the BBI, the court decides that is going to continue. So I think according to me, the time will be not enough for BBI to continue, but this BBI will wait until the election to be conducted. Because we are remaining with just few months to election, what is it possible to make BBI to continue, which according to me it is not possible? That is number one. Number two, BBI will make the, the Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance Brigade a point of campaign where they will be able to fight the Azimio Moja, which according to me, they are going to have some supporters that could have supported Azimio Moja. But now, with their convincing language, taking BBI as the campaigning tool towards gaining a sympathy vote in Kenya Kwanzaa, this will make Kenya Kwanzaa to thresh and to face this Azimilo Moja head on. Where I don't know how these people will defend themselves. Yes, they have good ideas and agendas with BBI but this thing will make now the Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance to have a tool of campaign which according to me it will not be a right time to make BBI to succeed for now or to make BBI a good stature or maybe a tool for Azimula Omoja to campaign on because they will start saying that all oh, these people are creating position for themselves. These people does not look forward when it comes to, to the economy. These people, they're just going to change the constitution, but they have not implemented this constitution of 2020. So this is the perspective way that we are looking now after the BBI will be said or will be uh, decided by the judge, Chief Justice, 
that BBI to continue, I think it will be now a lot of negative impact when it comes to Azimio la Umoja than in Kenya Kwanza Alliance. Let us go into the second perspective. The second perspective where now the judges will decide that the BBI was null and void and should not continue. And so now the process is going to be shut down and the BBI will not continue until the next time that these politicians or these leaders of Azimura uh, Omoja will decide now to further the process that now the court is proposing. So now this perspective of killing now BBI completely but the judges tomorrow will make this tool a strong tool for Azimiola Umoja to now face head on Kenya Kwanza Alliance, which, according to me, this will be a big percentage tool impact that will make Azimiola Umoja now to campaign with. They will say and tell Kenya and see these people we proposed that now when it comes to the leadership of women to be expanded but now Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance is opposing these proposals that we are putting out now Kenyans or women of the country will say yes you see these people are coming and telling us some issues but now when it comes to the women leadership we are safe agreeing with Azimiola Umoja number two they will claim about this one man, one vote, one shillings. Where they will say there are certain areas that the population is higher than the other, other places where the population is lower. But for example, when it comes to the CDF, the money that is being disbursed there, according to the constituency, constituencies, they are being given every year a hundred million Kenya shillings to now fund their projects in the constitutional level. So see, now they will come up and say, now you see these people are blocking the money that could have come or the money that could have been added to what you have been receiving. So now what about these people who are looking for leadership Yet they are rejecting the money that is coming from the national government to the local government through these leaders, MPs, and other leaders. And again, you see, they will come up again, number three. They will say that BBI was talking about inclusive leadership. Now including these small tribes into the government. But you see, now Kenya Kwanzaa Lands does not want this. So I think this two, uh, second scenario will make now Azimiola Umoja to have a big percentage and a positive impact when it comes to this BBI as a tool of campaigning. If now the judges will decide, now the BBI is dead, and is final and BBI is no longer and BBI is null and void. So what about what about your opinion and reasons? So without wasting time, just give your opinions and reasons at the comment section below as we wait what next for this BBI ruling tomorrow. So thank you so much. God bless you for watching me. If you're a visitor, subscribe, put on the notification bell that when I upload my videos, you get notified automatically by YouTube. Of course, in this channel, we analyze pure politics, we give opinions and reasons the way we understand politics across the country. And I'm humbled so much because of your great support. For those who are returning subscriber, subscribers, continue sharing, continue commenting, continue liking, so that we can be so much recommended in YouTube platform. So thank you so much. I'm humbled because of your sincere support and unconditional support.
to watch this channel thank you so much god bless you till next time bye bye